Recently, multiple media outlets have been praising a peculiar yet popular grade school drink, propping up some also peculiar headlines. Chocolate milk is supposedly superior in improving exercise recovery. And if we were to only read the headlines, then we'll probably be running off to our local Whole Foods, chunking out cash for all of their dairy cocoa goodness. But of course, as the critical thinkers you are, you're probably wondering how true exactly is this finding? To satisfy our speculation, all we have to do is to look at the source material of these articles, which all leads back to a meta-analysis and systematic review recently published in the European Journal of Clinical Nutrition. In this review, researchers looked at several chocolate milk studies and its effect on several key performance factors. Time to exhaustion, ratings of perceived exertion, heart rates, and fatigue factors such as serum lactate and creatine kinase levels. 12 studies overall were analyzed for systematic review and 11 of them for the meta-analysis. But let's cut to the chase to what the researchers found. Their results didn't exactly line up with much of the media statements. Upon analyzing the data, the researchers concluded that chocolate milk consumption as a post-exercise recovery drink did not significantly influence any of the factors measured. Only in a subgroup analysis did they find that chocolate milk was somewhat superior in improving time to exhaustion than a placebo or a carb, protein, and fat-containing drink. Overall, though, it did not improve in their primary findings. That's right, they found that chocolate milk overall wasn't superior whatsoever. It's also interesting to emphasize the placebo aspect, which is essentially just water. Let's think about that. It went up against water in some cases and didn't fare better. And frankly, we didn't even have to read past the first page of the study to see the very clear differences between the headlines we see in the media and the researchers' conclusions. That being said, chocolate milk might still have some benefits, but certainly not of the factors reviewed in this study, but rather simply its ingredients. Chocolate milk has carbs and fats, which can help with energy replenishment. And it has protein, specifically casein and whey, which support muscle growth and preservation. But you can also get this with other beverages that have much less added sugars or simply have a decent meal sometime after your workout. Anyway, although tasty, don't expect some sort of big nutritional enhancement with chocolate milk. That being said, I would like to hear from you guys. What's your thoughts on chocolate milk as a post-workout recovery drink? Or better yet, what's your thoughts with the seemingly continuous misreporting in fitness by the media? Let me know in the comments. Please thumbs up the video if you enjoyed it and share it with your chocolate milk loving friends. As always, thank you for watching and get your protein.